Okay, this is gonna be a little bit different of a question. Um, and, and, and if you were to take a photograph, and I guess I'm, I'm addressing this to uh, the mayor. If you were to take a photograph of North Adams, and you're looking down, you're looking at the schools and the arts, and the shopping, and, and the housing. If you were to take a photograph, go back, take, blow it up, and take a look at it, what would you see? What would you see in that photograph of North Adams? I see a very special community in so many ways. And if it was taken this weekend, it would have even been super because of the colors and the thousands and thousands of people that visit our city from Heritage Park to Mass Mocha to see the vibrancy that's alive in this community. I probably would have taken them over to the, uh, to the Alkenbright um, um, complex in the west end of the city, which we named in honor of uh, uh, Dick's father for his many years of service, and shown him the four to 500 kids that are there playing. Then I probably would have taken him down to the skating rink and showed him all the things that are going on there. I probably would have gotten him into the movie house too before they closed, but, uh, uh, <laughs> but uh, there's, a, there's a community that's alive, and you go downtown, and the tourists that were here this weekend, and the beauty, the beauty of this community, not only reflected by the church steeples that you see looking there, but the beauty in the people and uh, what they've been able to accomplish and how they've stayed the course over the several years um, that we've gone through difficult times. Uh, there's a lot of satisfaction among those people out there. And so that's a part of the community that, uh, that I would like them all to see because I have had more visitors come to this community, especially uh, mayors who said they haven't been here in a while. They can't believe North Adams is the same community they visited 10 and 15 years ago. There's, there's a life to it, which uh, we have a ways to go, but, but there's a life in this community. Uh, in the first debate, and, and I would agree with the mayor, I think if we did an aerial shot, um, things would look beautiful. I did say in the first debate that when you look down from above, it looks like we're in the palm of God's hand. Uh, and I still believe that firmly. However, I'm here as a candidate. I need to paint a picture here as to what the, what the real things that are happening, what people see in this community all the time. We are as urban, again I'll say, as West Springfield, as Chicopee, as Holyoke. What, we don't, what I'd want to see is a comparison shot. I'd want to see the picture from 1983 and I'd want to see the picture today. We've lost 6,000 people. We won't see 6,000 people. We're still virtually a one industry town and God bless the arts and creative for that because if not, I don't know where we'd be. Crime is up, we would see that in the photo. We'd see our middle class is shrinking and we'd see our poor growing. We'd see the poor growing and the middle class shrinking and the poor get poorer. And there are no jobs. I'd look down and I wouldn't see as many jobs as we saw 25 years ago. And there is no growth. But, but, but we have the lowest tax rate in the state. You know, I just don't get it. I just don't get it. Thank you. As Ronald Reagan would say, there you go again, Dick. I mean, painting a picture of this community that has come so far. We deal with the problems of the poor. We deal with those problems. We don't stick our, our head in the sand. And I think the other thing that you have to realize, too, is this economy is 100 times better than it was 26 years ago. It was a one industry community. We rebuilt it. We have more people in the job force today. And unfortunately, we have not lost 6,000 people. Uh, my first year as mayor, I believe our, our, we were in the area of 14,600 people. When the census came along in 1990, it went up to 16.7. And I guaranteed if the federal government does their job this time around, they're going to find that we're well over $15,000, 15,000 people. <laughs>